SolidWorks Plastics Professional not only provides designers with intuitive tools to streamline the development of their plastic parts, but also offers integrated solutions to predict and avoid manufacturing defects and costly mold rework. The first step for setting up a new simulation is to mesh the model. The part can be meshed automatically, or we can specify parameters to manually control every aspect. The density and the quality of the final mesh is controlled by the triangle size, and local refinements can be used to automatically create more elements in small areas and around features like ribs and holes, giving you more accurate results. Once the mesh is created, we can move forward with setting up the rest of our analysis. This includes selecting the plastic material that will be used to manufacture this cradle. SolidWorks Plastics comes with a very extensive database of over 4,000 grades of commercial plastics with detailed rheological and thermal properties. For this particular application, we can choose a polycarbonate ABS blend that offers great impact resistance and strength. The last step is to specify the injection location where the melted plastic will enter the cavity. This can be changed later on to explore different design alternatives and optimize the plastic part for injection molding. We can now run this study and after a pre-processing phase, we can see that the preview results are dynamically displayed on screen as the analysis is being solved. This allows plastics part designers to ensure that the analysis is set up correctly. SolidWorks Plastics offers a wide range of useful results that will help you make sure you can mold this part properly. The fill time plot, for example, shows how the melted plastic flows, making it easy to identify potential problems. In this particular case, we have a short shot, meaning that no matter what we do, we just can't get the plastic to fill 100% of the cavity. Without leaving our SolidWorks environment, we can modify this part and increase the wall thickness in an effort to fix this problem. Leveraging configurations, we can very quickly run multiple what-if scenarios to explore design ideas and refine our part design. After loading the results for this new design, the first thing that comes up is the advisor. The traffic light on the top lets you instantly know if the injection molding process would be successful. It also explains all the different result plots and gives some advice, if necessary, on how to troubleshoot and fix potential problems. The fill time plot shows that we can now fill 100% of this cavity without reaching the maximum injection pressure of our molding machine. In addition, the pressure and volumetric shrinkage at the end of fill and the sink mark plot provide critical insight to predict defects like short shots, sink marks, warpage, or even weld lines. Also, cooling time can help estimate the cycle time and optimize production. SolidWorks Plastics Professional is an invaluable tool for any plastics part designer to predict and avoid manufacturing, structural, and cosmetic defects. SolidWorks applications provide great capabilities you can use right away for design, simulation, communication, and file management to work faster and make your products better. Explore all the features in the demo library or contact your nearest SolidWorks reseller.